A tribute to Vietnam War veterans is visiting the Morgan County Fairgrounds, a scaled down replica of Washington, D.C.'s Vietnam Memorial Wall. WRTV's Todd Simmons tells us how this is helping heal the pain of a generation. 58,281 names, all of them veterans who did not get to come home from Vietnam. The ones who were able to come back are now making sure these names will be remembered forever. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50. Steve Passwater and Constantine Tiyunin were classmates at Noblesville High, and both were drafted to serve in Vietnam after graduation. So I thought to myself, oh my goodness, I got to tell my dad, and he's not going to be real happy with it. Everybody has the same story. When the door of the aircraft opened, the heat and the humidity came inside the airplane. Some of their classmates' stories ended in Vietnam. In Grant. So the Army veterans searched this wall of fallen soldiers until they found their fellow Millers. Yeah, Michael H. Warren. Can't hit him, he's so, so high. This traveling monument is now in Martinsville, and it's a therapeutic place for veterans who often had to hide their struggles when they got home. I get emotional thinking about it, so. But uh, just thankful that uh, our names aren't on that wall. The last American troops left Vietnam 50 years ago, so even the youngest Vietnam veterans are likely retired. Ellen Wilson Pruitt takes this wall around America to give all generations a chance to remember those who served long after they're laid to rest. If it gives one veteran closure or one school kid a better idea, then it's been, it's been worth it. Passwater and Tiyunin are still wrestling to find inner peace after the Vietnam War. This wall and the teenagers learning from it builds hope for their twilight years. When we came home, we didn't talk. Nobody asked us how things were other than family. We normally didn't mention Vietnam, but now with the wall, uh, you walk out here and people come up to you and say, thank you for your service. In Martinsville, Taj Simmons, WRTV. Well, the traveling Vietnam Memorial Wall will be open 24 hours a day at the Morgan County Fairgrounds until the organizers pack it up on Sunday afternoon. It is the only time the traveling wall will appear in Indiana this year.